What are lovely American cousins? I bet you never thought one of these, your lovely American RVs, would be on roads like this. What are they? I'm just thinking. It's raining tonight. Oh, yeah, you're really on this. Yeah. Normally, we would choose our routes very carefully to places that we would go to, but because it was for a TV show and they want to keep secrets, they don't tell us where we're going until the last minute. So normally, we would never drive on roads like this unless it was just maybe the last mile or so to a campsite. A couple of scary facts. A gallon of fuel in our country is around nine dollars, and we have to have an HGV heavy goods vehicle license to drive these vehicles, which is about one to two thousand pounds. Poor daddy's having a fucking turn. Right, is the trees? I know. Right, I think if you start really float slowing down. We're driving through a village or a town called Nares for at the moment and luckily we have a cockpit in front of us. This is the little action woman up on the roof of the RV. She is literally Lara Croft in disguise and she very bravely jumped up onto the RV roof and was holding back branches. Let's just make sure she gets down safely. I'm just going to see what can sway that next. Can you sway that? Can you happy with that? Yeah, she held it. She's all right. We are getting quite a few looks from the locals as we drive through a town in Yorkshire in an American RV. Luckily, nobody's sworn at us yet. Go, go, go. I hope this has been interesting for any lovely American people who have ever wondered where their vehicles end up. And we hope you tune back in for our next adventures, which we'll be posting soon. For all our lovely British motorhomers, please tune in September, Channel 4, 5 o'clock, and watch the show.